LGBTQ Iowans sharing their fears about how certain legislation coming from the state house would impact them. Local 5's Nora J.S. Reichard was speaking with one local family earlier this afternoon. She joins us now. Nora, tell us what they had to say. Larissa, the Iowa legislature has seen a record-setting volume of bills this session involving LGBTQ Iowans, many of them centered around schools specifically. But students and their family members say the impact isn't left in the classroom. House File 180 would require schools to notify families if a student identifies as trans and bans any accommodations to affirm the student's gender without their consent. That's hard for 16-year-old Elliot Sutton, a local trans high school student, to think about. If these laws pass, it might have to go back to my legal name, and then I have to go back to reminding every substitute and being like, hey, but this time they don't have to. Elliot's been out to their parents for about two for me, years. It's, it's just been an amazing blossoming of Elliot uh, in becoming who they truly are. But lately, amidst a nationwide legislative battle around trans issues, they've been growing more worried about their child. I already know that there have been other kids that have verbally harassed Elliot in the halls of the school. Uh, that angers me. And as the Suttons have been dealing with that anger, they've also started thinking about something that no parent ever wants to. I think it's hard to find words to express the gravity and the weight that you feel at even the thought that you might have to send your child somewhere where they'll be safe because there is a place where you're rooted where they are not necessarily safe. The family hasn't made any concrete plans to leave Iowa at this point, but they tell me the option is on the table. And as statehouse debates continue, Elliot told me they hope legislators can remember one thing. Trans kids are still children, and we still would also like to be protected and seen as people, so. According to one Iowa, more than 20 total bills impacting LGBTQ Iowans have been introduced this session.